All right, y'all, come along as I attempt to repair this missing piece in front of my fender because the new fender is $500, and I don't think I want to pay $500. I already got scam off of the 335i that I bought with a blown turbo, so we're going to try to save some money and um, save this fender. So I'm going to use my other 3 series that I have. I've never tried this before, but... It is a learning process and who knows i might just save this fender so i covered the front end of this fender and i'm gonna use fiberglass sheets to create a mold then i'm gonna take the mold off after it's cured and i'm gonna put it on the red fender and let's see if this works or not all right yeah this is the finished piece sorry about my filming skills because i don't know why i'm pointing it down at the ground for but you guys can visualize how this is gonna go i wish i would have made the piece a little bit longer because i don't know if it's gonna actually have enough to adhere to the you know the rest of the fender but i have it bonded and then the very next day i waited for it to cure i do need to find something to bond underneath the fender so it doesn't end up falling off in a car wash or if i walk past or something get caught up on it uh, but i'm figuring this up as i go and the very next day i use a little bit of body filler and this is me priming it and blending it out and this is the finished product is it perfect probably not can you tell the car was painted i mean the front fender was painted and blended out you can't really tell actually and i think i did a pretty good job for someone that doesn't really do this and it was my first job blending um clear into the existing clear i do want to shout out um um what's his name i might be hacking it it's jay lulo on youtube he made a blending video thank you for that